long time ago in a city called Montreal. I remember the first time I met you. It was in Molson Hall. We were living together on the floor, and you were doing beer pong the first time I saw you. You're amazing at beer pong, I remember. I was impressed by your skills, which I unfortunately didn't have. But now I see you at Provigo, shopping with your kids. And really, there's nothing that I hate more than the way you shop as a soccer mom. It's so sad to see what you've turned into. Oh, I'm so sad. But I cannot imagine what your husband is going through. your body in my bed. Remember the time the counter broke? We were freaked out. has everything you need in case of a pregnancy. Oh, the time you got pregnant was the first time, but I hope that one of those kids ain't mine, because I would hate to be a father and learn it a provigo. Better not tell my husband that one of his kids are yours. We were so into it. I don't know. Well, you should know. <laughs> it's so hot in my room. I wish I had your sexy body to open my window. I don't know what else to say. Oh, what a terrible coincidence that biology had brought to us. That your kid turned out to be a ginger, just like me. When your husband is six foot tall and a black dude, <laughs> this coincidence is really weird, but I'm pretty sure we can find an excuse.